Movement is eye travel directed by visual pathways in a work of art. Methods such as line, implied line, and psychic force or implied force can prompt the eye to move around the picture plane. An example of psychic line that directs the eye to move across the work of art would be the famous Baroque oil painting, Shepherd Boy Pointing at Tobias and the Angel, by Dutch artist Abraham Blumart. A much more abstracted example of work that moves the viewer's eye around are the paintings by Dutch artist Piet Mondrian. He uses line and dotted or implied line to move your eye around the picture plane. A good example of this would be his work titled Broadway Boogie Woogie. This particular piece allows the viewer's eye to follow the path of lines, much like you are overlooking a maze. A reading from Homer, a painting by Sir Lawrence Alma Tadema, uses psychic lines to show movement. The direction in which the subject's eyes are looking towards moves the viewer's eye to the subject on the right. Sacred Mountains by Gauguin has an open space and towards the center, which takes the viewer's eye around the perimeter of the painting. The Large Bathers, a painting by Renoir, shows eye contact between the two subjects in the front, which focused a viewer's eye to move between them at first before traveling around the rest of the painting. The painting titled Still Life with Pipe, Violin, and a Bottle of Bass by Pablo Picasso shows the use of miscellaneous shapes and mark making which move the viewer's eye around the entirety of the composition, starting at the top, moving towards the bottom, and then horizontally and diagonally. This piece by Bruce Nauman is titled The True Artist Helps the World by Revealing Mystic Truths. The spiral text allows the viewer's eye to start in the center and move outward in a spiral motion. This piece by Michelangelo Pistoletto is titled Persine Che Gardano. The figures on the far left seem to be looking towards the center of the composition, which moves the viewer's eyes from them towards their own reflection. This piece, titled Abstraction, by Jacques Villon, has depth, which takes the viewer's eye towards the back of the composition and back into space. The squiggle line shows movement within the somewhat bland composition. This very busy piece, titled Spring Sale at Bendel's by Florian Setheimer, has a very busy composition, moving the eye over the entirety of the piece. This piece, titled Physical Culture, by Francine Picaba, shows a large variety of shapes, and the direction in which they seem to be moving almost overwhelms the eye as it moves from shape to shape as well as within each shape. <laughs> 